I'm Ross Halleck. And I'm Harris Miner. And we're here at Halleck Vineyard to do another uh, tasting of two wines back to back. In this case, we're going to be enjoying the uh, La Crema Monterey 2019 Pinot Noir against the Halleck Vineyard Hillside Cuvée 2018 Pinot Noir. La Crema is Monterey. The Hillside is Sonoma Coast. Uh, the alcohol on the La Crema is 13.5%, and the uh, alcohol on Halleck Vineyard is 14%. So let's start with the color. Okay. So it looks like um, the Halleck is a little more purple. Yes, I'd say that the Halleck is, is, it definitely leads towards the purple. Um, if, if I were to compare two different stones, I might say that the the uh, color of the uh, Monterey is garnet, and the color of the uh, Sonoma Coast, uh, the Hillside Cuvée, is ruby. Um, but very close, um, uh, beautiful colors, translucent, both of them. Um, let's uh, let's start with the Monterey and 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 taste the, and go for the nose here. Mm. So I think this has some toasted oak because I get that butterscotch flavor. Mm -hmm. I should say. Yeah. It's a nice balance of earth and fruit in the nose. I mean, you get both of them here. Mm -hmm. There's cherries for sure. Mm -hmm. There's kind of a, um, a funky mushroomy thing. Mm -hmm. In a good way. In a good way, yeah. Definitely some earth. Mm -hmm. It's well balanced mm -hmm. in the nose. Yeah, there's a, some plum notes as well. I'd say cherries and plum are, are, are sort of lean on the, the fruit side. <laughs> And uh, you had mentioned earlier a little uh, beef jerky. There's there's sort of a um, yeah. There's like curing spices, kind of, and almost a smokiness. Mm -hmm. Very rich mouthfeel. Yeah, I think most of those notes are confirmed. Mm -hmm. I think it leads towards the earth and the fruit in the in the in the flavor profile. It really does taste like jerky in the uh, in the mouth. And mm -hmm. there's some dried cherry for mm -hmm. sure. Mm -hmm. Um, there's earth. It's a little thin on the flavor, I think. It kind of drops off quickly at the yeah. end. It doesn't have a long finish. So this wine is uh, $26. And uh, what would you pair this? Well, it tastes like beef jerky. Yeah. So I... mushroom jerky or beef jerky would be great. So let's move over to the Halleck Vineyard Hellside Cuvée. Well, it's interesting when you put these two wines together, the, the contrast in, in how this uh, smells because in different contexts, it smells differently. And I'm very surprised at this time, the fruit really comes through. Yeah, big raspberry, uh, cranberry aromas. I get a, um, a shocking minerality that I always associate with this one. And there is a hint of that white pepper too, which is kind of related to the minerality. They have a similar uh, profile. They do, and but I think compared to the, the other wine, which is more earthy, this it brings out the fruit. In oh, this absolutely, wine. yeah. And normally, I, this this wine has a nice balance of that, though that earthy, that funky note, and I don't get it at all this time. Mm, the acidity is very bright. Yeah, this is a, this is a, a much brighter wine. It's a little thinner in mouthfeel, but it doesn't um, disappoint in terms of flavor. The flavor comes through big time. Yeah, bright fruit. Um, there's kind of a, a musky note that I always associate with this wine as well. And then, yeah, also that mushroomy, uh, woodsy scents and minerals. Mm -hmm. And certainly the cranberry and raspberry show through. There's, oh, absolutely. There's definitely that, those, those bright red fruit flavors. So this wine is uh, $57 versus the $26 for the uh, La Crema. And uh, what would you pair this with? Oh, this is great with a, a nice lean salmon. You don't want anything with too much fat because this is a lean wine. Um, on the grill, especially, it would be amazing. Yeah, I agree. I think this would be a great salmon wine. Anyway, I hope you enjoy. Thanks for joining us. Please like and subscribe.